Hey, I'm Hashem, you're watching Pushing Film. In this video, I'm gonna show you a quick and easy tip on how to check if film is loaded inside of a 35 mil film SLR like this one. Let's get straight to it. All you really need to do is without pressing the rewind release button or switch. So remember, don't press the rewind release. Just flip up the rewind crank and give it a couple of gentle turns just to see if you hit any tension. Now that's all it really is. And I know a lot of people might already know this, but this video is for those who don't know about this. And as you can see in this overhead view where I've shown a bit of an x-ray vision kind of view of inside the camera, the reason why this works is that if film is correctly hooked up onto the take-up spool, as you rotate that rewind crank without having pressed the rewind release, you should eventually hit tension, showing that the film is hooked up onto that take-up spool because you haven't pressed the rewind release, remember? And this is just a quick and easy way to test if the film is correctly on the take-up spool or simply if you even have film in the camera. So maybe you've had a camera sitting around for ages and you can't remember if you had film in it and you don't want to open the door to check. So again, you can use a simple trick without pressing the rewind release button or switch, rotate the rewind crank just to see if there's any tension. And remember to do this gently. And if you do hit that tension, don't force it too much. You just want to check if there is film in there. And the reason this works, which you might already know if you see my other video on how to load a film camera, and I'll put that in a card above here in case you haven't seen it, is because when film is correctly loaded onto the take-up spool, it will cause it to be pulled out of the film canister, which is then connected to the rewind spool, which will also turn with every time you advance the camera. So that's another good way to check if film is correctly loaded in the camera while you're shooting. What you want to notice is that each time you take a shot and advance, the little rewind spool should turn. Now it won't always turn every single time because sometimes a little bit of slack can build up. And if there is a bit of slack and it's not always turning with every advance, that's fine. You can always just use that trick of just giving it a gentle couple of turns just to see if there's tension. So that's it guys, nice simple way to test if you have film loaded into a 35 mil SLR like this one. I know a lot of you might have already known about this, but I'm sure a lot of you didn't because I get a lot of questions about this on Instagram and I hope that maybe it helped a few of you guys out. So if you did find it helpful, I'll leave a few links in the description of this video to give you options on a few ways you can support the channel if you want to. And uh, otherwise, yeah, I hope you found this helpful and I'll see you on the next episode of Pushing Film.